there's this quote from one of my friends, Alex Hormozzi, that says, you don't become confident by shouting affirmations in the mirror. I make a pretty decent French toast. I will put on a shirt. I know how to keep promises to myself. I draw pretty good squirrels. I am not yet completely bald. I think my dog actually really likes me. I am not an asshat. I'm just fine. I'm pretty good even. But by having a stack of undeniable proof that you are who you say you are, outwork your self-doubt. Since when did self-help and feeling better become a zero-sum game? Affirmations are like power poses or meditation. They work for some people. And in mental health, almost always, whatever works is a good thing. And these guys making fun of it in a really poorly lit room isn't helping anybody. I think screaming affirmations into the mirror is great. It doesn't actually make me feel any better in my mental health but it's a lot of fun and I really like thinking of the stupidest thing I can think of to scream into the mirror. But what I think is even more interesting is where the man in the shadows is right is in talking about how action is usually going to be something that can help you and it's almost always going to be better than inaction. But that doesn't really seem like that much of an epiphany. Basically, getting out of bed is gonna be better than staying in bed all day and staring at the ceiling. Some of the best advice that I got when I was first starting to realize that I was dealing with some anxiety, especially in the morning, was a friend who told me, just in passing, get up early. And it took me a long time to realize that just getting up and getting moving actually helps me to kind of push through whatever's happening. Now, the problem that I think I have with a lot of what we're gonna see on the internet is you get people that have gone through something and they take whatever has worked for them and they look straight into the camera and they say, if you do this, you will get the same result that I did. And that's just not how mental health works. It's different for everybody. So whether it's affirmations, a walk in the woods, or acupressure, whatever it is that works for you, you just stick with it and you do you. And don't worry about what poorly lit men in very dark rooms on the internet are talking about or saying. And what they also don't tell you when they're giving you all these miracle solutions on the internet or snappy inspirational quotes is that all these little things that help are not the cure. They're just a way to keep going. There's this quote from one of my friends, Gandhi, that says, sometimes big problems are best solved with lots of small creative solutions. That's, that's nailed. Nailed. Completely nailed. Yes.